Welcome back, Ryder, to Grab a Gamer. Welcome back, Logan. You're Ryder, and I'm Logan. And we're oh, playing... We're playing The Witcher 3. We're not playing The Witcher 3. We're playing uh, oh. um, Jack and Daxter. Did I save this? Did it autosave? Does this game have autosave feature? It may have autosave feature. That's fine. We're just going to save where this one and go. Welcome to The Witcher 3. Or maybe I saved it. I don't remember. This is not The Witcher 3. So, right now, we're going to go over to that spooky island where Dax got turned into um, an also. An also? It's Tiff a ferret. No. Tiff already told us what an also was, actually. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. It's uh, an otter mixed with a weasel. An what? An otter and a weasel. An also. Oh. Does, does he not look like an otter and a weasel to you? Uh, not really. Well, fun. <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say. <laughs> uh, you want me to agree with that? Like, yeah. No, I don't believe it. Yeah. Okay. I want you to okay. give in. So welcome to Misty Island. Um. This place gives me the creeps. You made a weird noise. It's a weird noise. Well, what was that? <laughs> I was like, I hope that, like, I hope that leads to more. <laughs> uh oh. So, are we gonna get demonetized for this? <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> oh no. Fire. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, a little tear tar. A little science. Look at this man. He's got a bone. He's swinging. Did he hit his friend? I was hoping so. But oh, he did it. No, I did. I hit him. Don't give him my credit. You hit him it's twice. the muse. This guy. Yeah, you got him twice. Once his dagger wants to kill. Look here, Muse. Oh. No, I did it intentionally because I wanted to get these things. Uh huh. I did. Oh, I'll just miss that thing. You're gonna sell me on being an expert at this game. It takes multiple hits! I pretty sure die. Alright, hold on. I, I like how he has the decency to wait on you. Yeah, it's a common courtesy to taunt me. It's okay, because I want to collect these things first. Fire. You missed one. Okay, got it. Nice. Okay, I want to go down here because I want to get these things. Because if I don't get them, I'm going to forget. Mm -hmm. There he is. No! No! You have to physically attack him? Yeah. Stop! Stop tormenting me! <laughs> no! <laughs> Come back! The mist! Oh, it's a box. <sighs> wow, you're doing great. Where'd he go? Which way did he There he is. Freeze! Yeah! What does this yeah. get you? That's the muse. That's, that gives me the power cell from the art guy. That's what he wanted. Oh. It's kind of cute. I've yeah. kind of forgotten. Yeah, he's a hippie among the hippies. I think I got everything over here. Alright. So yeah, this is where, like, the island where all the bad guys come from. This is where, sure, of course, where Maya and Gol were being bad guys. Well, we can see why they're bad guys. They live in a very low income, low income area. They're impoverished. They got nothing. They got nowhere else to turn. I don't think that's the case in these guys. No, that's usually what the case is. The Batman could do a lot more, a lot better for his community if he just funneled money into certain areas of Gotham. I just throw a hole. Are you, are you right over there? I, uh, uh, our uh, manager over here just had a weird stumble, just standing there and then just, <laughs> just almost fell over. Balance. Did you have a little to drink before you came over? No? Okay. Uh... I wouldn't blame you if you did. I wouldn't blame you. Yeah, you were a lot to deal with. Especially with Ryder. Okay. Um. Oh, hey, right. There's Red Eco over there. What do you think Red Eco does? Um, gives you fire powers. No. Oh. Really? Yeah. It doesn't do that? No, it doesn't. What does it do for you? It makes you strong. That was my second guess. No, I'm strong. You one punch that guy. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, what other colors are there again? We have red and green and... Red, green, yellow, blue, uh, and dark. And eventually dark. Okay. Um, well, I guess it's not eventually. I guess you fell into it. Yeah. 
there's already Dark Eco going on. Isn't there Light Eco? Or is that a different game? There is Light Eco. It is a different game. There's... We need Blue Eco to charge this platform yes, up! Yes, thank you. Another Eco. Yes, thank you. I have to be able to get enough of it to get over there, though. So I'm gonna... Okay. Is, go. is this gonna be... It's ready. I don't... Man, he's excited. He loves Red Eco. I don't want Red Eco right now. I want Blue Eco. How did that hit me? Ooh, dang. He just loves that. How did that hit me? Okay. Is that gonna be enough? I feel like you wasted your time. Oh! <laughs> oh that's unfortunate. Frog, stop! Okay, hold on. Ooh, good job. You don't need to heckle. Oh, heck on. Tiff already does that enough. You heckle. Okay, we got three bursts. We're gonna get there in time. By the way, I don't even need to roll jump. We'll be fine. Oh, I missed the mainland. Oh, Tenekids is on two different islands. You see? You mean the plateau that you're standing on? Well, it would just like the, the game. This is a separate island from the rest of the island. Oh, I guess you're right. And now you're stuck up here. My ride left me. Oh, it's back. Well, Ryder. Mm -hmm. We had to buy a new water heater today. Yeah? I didn't... What an exciting story. Let's tell it. We lost... <laughs> Let's tell this exciting story. Let's tell this. I, you know, it's, it's adventure and adulting. Well, have you yeah, okay. in this household has not taken a shower that, in the last three days? Yeah. It is just. It is. <laughs> it is a water buffet of smells. It's just this cold water. I, I boiled some water last night. Apparently, cold. You're supposed to shower in cold water. It's Only if freaking. you're an insane person. Like, but it's like, it's winter right now in Oklahoma. So that's a death sentence. Oh right. I'm in an arena. I see that. I like this arena. I have one hit until I'm dead though. Which is fun on hard mode. Concerning. Um, Dark Souls mode. <laughs> Be gone. Uh. Oh wait, can Red Eco break these boxes? I want to collect some of that green that they're dropping. Hey, Jim. <laughs> but I want to test to see if these stay. I gotta. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Again, you might want to collect that green that they're dropping. I'm trying! There's a lot following me! Alright, look, I got enough. Alright, there we go. It's not quite so Dark Souls anymore. It's a little less. I, I did it. I didn't even get hit once. There's another Hershey Kiss Man, though. Um, so, yeah, I boiled some water last night to give myself a sponge bath. You gave yourself a sponge bath? I gave myself a sponge bath with boiled water. Cool it off. I felt fun and refreshed. <laughs> boiled water, like, live in the Old West. Yeah. You gotta do what you gotta do, man. And I had to do it. Stank. He's still not stank. He's trying to stink. Oh god. I cologne. I, I use cologne. Well, I use cologne too. It doesn't make you not stink. I'm in a, I'm in a bad way again, Parker. Oh. No. You're right, good job. I, I'm. I tell you, I'm the best at this game. You know, I was thinking uh, about a superhero that Disney owns. Nor would I say. Yeah, I am. Uh, but uh, I was thinking about a superhero that Disney owns that they don't do anything with, and I, it really kind of makes me sad. What? Uh, uh, the Rocketeer. You've talked about the Rocketeer before. Not on this, have I? Well, no. But she mentioned. Yeah. Ah. Oh. I. I don't think that one was my fault. I'm pretty sure the blue eco boosts me. Oh! Oh, you have to fight these guys again. No, I don't. Bah. Tell me about this Rocketeer and why he's your favorite superhero. He's my favorite superhero, but he's a pretty awesome villain. He's your favorite superhero. He's pretty close. Uh, 
I don't know, like, uh, it was a it was a comic book back in the 90s that was set in uh, the 1940s. In the 90s. In the 90s, yeah, you're right. Uh, I think it was, well, it was either the late 80s or the, the early 90s that this comic book came out, but it was, uh, it was about a dude who was a... Uh, he was a, I think, a stunt pilot, or something. Yeah, I think he was a stunt pilot, and uh, he found like this jetpack that like some Nazi spies were uh, transporting, and that they stole from the, the the genius aviator and inventor of the time, Howard Hughes, who is what Tony Stark is based off of. Yeah. Uh, in the story, Howard Hughes develops a jetpack that runs on love. Yeah, al alcohol, like gin. Yeah. Gin, booze, anything boozy. It's kind of like love. Yeah, kind of like love. It is love. But, uh... At least in my experience. Uh... Oh. <laughs> Shelly. Oh. Uh... But, uh... Anyway, yeah, that's what the jetpack ran on. But it was very, like, Art Deco. Uh, like, uh, the, the dude was fighting Nazis, and he had, like, a, a jetpack. And it, it's, just a, it's just a cool concept. It's just takes place in a world that's kind of, like, a stylized 1930s and 40s. That's... Just where your main hero is just some dude who's good good at piloting planes and has a jetpack. You like stuff like that. You like old stuff. I do like old stuff. Like, but I like I like living in the modern era where I can have cool new stuff. Yeah. I'm not those kind of people. You know, that they'd be like, man, I would just it was enough. I would just thrive in the 1930s because I don't think I would. No, you <laughs> die at all. You die almost immediately. Yeah, I probably would. Like a tuberculosis or syphilis or something. Wow. Well, okay. Well. Yeah. A rogue donkey kicking you. Probably. I can see you dying via donkey kick. No. No. But uh. <laughs> but no, I like that. I like a uh, like concept, and I wish Disney would do more with it since they own the hero and they're not like they're just sitting on it. Maybe. And maybe uh, time will come. There was a rumor. There was a rumor out there that said uh, that the Rocketeer was going to make an appearance of some kind in the MCU, but like I'm not sure how they would do it. I think it was like a what if episode was rumored. I think that's what it was. It was a what if episode was rumored that it might be the Rocketeer to introduce them into the MCU, which would have been cool. But they didn't do that. Well, no, they're doing other episodes of. of yeah, no, they're doing what other what ifs. But if Disney oh, if wants to make something. About the Rocketeer, just you'd, give me a call. You'd watch it. No, just give me a call. I'll write it. I'll write the show for it. Cause I love, I love, I love that character. And I feel like I could do a good job. Maybe you could. Maybe you can. Okay, well, jeez, man. I, yeah, I, I got believe a degree it. in that. <laughs> got a degree in rocketeering. Yeah, I got a degree in rocketeering. Pretty intense. Not the, not the writing in English, but. No. So yeah, Disney, if you, if you're out there, yep. there's a. What is it? Bob Iger is out there listening to this. I don't know. Like you got like a, a son or a daughter or a nephew or a niece. Maybe he's just into it, and uh, they're happening to like hear this message right now in your Disney limousine. <laughs> Mickey Mouse ears on top of it. It's got, yeah, it's got Mickey Mouse ears on top of it. Uh, give me a call. Let me know if I can help you write a Rocketeer show well, yeah. for Disney Plus, and I'll. Uh, I guarantee you. I guarantee you, Bob Iger, that I can produce quality stuff. Quality stuff. Quality. Right. Is that is that your like elevator pitch? That's my elevator pitch. That's this is me trying to quit this and get to Disney. <laughs> this is episode four. You can't. You, no. I already got my my. I got my sights on higher planes, dude. <laughs> How do I get off this thing? Here we go. No. I hope I don't fall into that pit of goo. Okay, then we're good. I'll never forget the little people that got me where I am, though. <laughs> me? Yeah. Well, I forget you. I, uh. And the friendship that we had. Mad? Are you just you're gonna fully abandon me if you go to Disney? What a fully. Oh, this is like fully. I'll keep you around for something. Scout, go to Scout, the steps. Like really, he really wants up here. Go to the steps, bud. Do you know where the steps? Yeah. There you go. No. There you go. Good job. Don't you had to get up there. Good boy. He just wants you to do it for him. 
Oh, are you coming over here? Tiff, Tiff add another uh, superimposed image of Scout up in the skyline. <laughs> are you just waiting for me to like look at the skyline so that way that can happen? Or do you say skyline because you know I'll look over at the skyline? No, I mean, it's worked so far. It has. Yeah. I say skyline, and your your camera automatically pans over to skyline right there. Be there it is. That <laughs> coincidence. I'm gonna ride this chip thing. He just sitting on my lap, staring at me. That's yeah, how it does. That's what that dog does. Flew away just in time. All right. Watch this. Watch this. Dead. Damn, dude. Dead. You did that guy dirty. Dirty. Dead. Ugh. He just like. You sneezed on my arm. You almost died there. I did almost die, but I didn't. This thing's a little wow, a little hard. Wow. To Turns your tight. Yeah, can I go slow a little bit? Okay. You recently played that Guardians of the Galaxy game. Oh, I surprisingly I love that Guardians of the Galaxy game. I didn't think I was. Going to enjoy it you as love much. Guardians of the Galaxy. I do like. You Guardians never stop talking about Guardians I, of the Galaxy. I, I, when, whenever we're not recording, the la <laughs> that's all he ever talks about. I get up in the morning. He's like, Ryder, let me talk to you about Guardians of the Galaxy. Let me tell you all like, about Rocket Raccoon. Logan, I just I just had bad news from the doctor. Yeah, but have you heard about like, what happened to Groot? And Groot. Yeah, and I'm just like, God. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Um. Don't. Oh my God. I, I wanted it to happen. Oh, I didn't kill him though. It just took out the. Oh, oh. Okay. Wow, he likes to complain. Yeah, he does. He likes. To... Yeah. Reminds me of you. That's uh. Is there... No, I. Oh, you missed it. <laughs> uh, I like the Guardians game. I was a little worried. Yeah. Because the Avengers game from Square Enix, it was all right, but it wasn't great. Sure. I, yeah, I had fun with it. I played Thor. I'm a big Thor boy. I have a Thor tattoo. Mm -hmm. Um, you. That's right. You uh, you play Thor for kids. I do. What well, well, kids is not animals. I do. I'm a right. I'm a right guy. Got a hero. Um, yeah. Oh my god! And it's so humble too. I play one on on TV. I have actually been on TV as Thor. Please don't. I played a doctor on uh, Days of Our Lives. Days of Our Lives, that's right. No, but uh, but the Guardians thing. So the Guardians was made by Square Enix uh, as well. And I was I was apprehensive. apprehensive. Come on. Wow. I, I got I to gotta just gun it, honestly. Uh, I was apprehensive because of the Avengers game. Sure. Um... Wow, that almost did, right? It almost did. Uh, but I got it half off. Yeah. And it was really good. Nice. A great... So, yeah, the mechanics of the game were a little bit janky, but... Uh, I'm sure some patches will be made for that. Yeah. They probably already have. Um, but there was nothing that was like... Ruin the game. Sure. Um, but the story was pretty fantastic. Like, it was sad. It was funny. Mm-hmm. Mm uh, and it was, it was pretty intense. Yeah, it's, all... it's all about overcoming grief. It's a good message. It is. Yeah. All right. So we're not quite done with this island. We just have to get two more scout flies and a few more eggs. Yeah, six more orbs. Just like those eggs. And then we're done with Misty Island. And then we'll go into the fire cannon. But I think we'll do that on the next episode. Are we? Are we going through this game pretty quick? It's a pretty short game, honestly. Okay, fair enough. Uh, especially when I remember what I'm doing. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Okay. All right, well. That's good. You me. got anything? You always ask me if I have something to say at the end. What do you got to say at the end? Um, Kiss your children. You never know when it's the last time you might. All right. Moment <laughs> Mori! Until, until next episode. <laughs> Goodbye!